Cotto potentially knocked out. Wow. Landing a good series of strikes here. Inside leg kick. That one hurts. All right, so there's a swing and a miss from him, and sometimes when you miss, it can tax your gas tank even more than when you land a strike. So clearly, it is energy. He got clipped there. He got hurt. He's in a lot of trouble. Some real power shots here. Knee to the body. Body kick, look at that. Well, Joe, you gotta fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Excellent movement here on the ground. He's back in his side control I here. Need you to get control of his wrist. And busy as he looks to improve position I need here. You to scramble, scramble. Back to the feet now. Inside leg kick. Get out of there. Separate. He Get is all about that back. left kick to the Good body. Shot. Good shot. How about Good. that shot? Wow. Wow. Oh, very nice. He's got him hurt here. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Give me some head movement now. Oh! Wow! Come on, you got to keep melting. That's it. Really starting to make these shots. That's it. Wow! Wow! Ground and pound KO. How about the ground and pound to finish the fight, Joe? That is as good an offensive execution as we have seen on the ground in recent memory. One big shot. We set it inside.
All right, coming up next, it's a UFC middleweight division fight. Our tale of the tape for this much-anticipated middleweight encounter. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with the same height and reach. All right, now, for the official introductions, we send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a kickboxer. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Detroit, Michigan, USA, the Warrior. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a mixed martial artist. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Tokyo, Japan, Lover. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Bergliata. Dan Mergliata, your referee. You ready? You ready? Let's well, go good fight. to have you with us, and right on time, I might add, as we get underway here at the O2 Arena in London. Oh, good kicks. Oh, boy, what a shot. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. Can't break your will. Stop high. Top foot going down to the basement. Nice switch. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. It's a high one. Beautiful timing with the left hand. What a jab. This is crazy. Oh, my goodness. Big left hand. Huge left hand. Just picking him apart. Oh, huge shot there. Lands flush. Wow, he is getting off some massive kicks. Well, this is chopping up a lead leg 101. This is exactly the way you do it as the leg kicks continue to pile up. And you can already start to see his opponent slowing down a little bit. May want to check one of those, bro. Keep going! Keep going! Flips to avoid the run. Nice jab! Whoa! He's got him hurt here. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block! Blocking all the shots coming towards his head. Oh! What a leg kick! He landed another nice leg kick there. How about that shin? He landed a couple good shots here. Oh! This could be it! Body kick, look at that! Nice knee there! Playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the body. And that one certainly found the target. Oh, he hurt him. That hurt him. Oh, he missed that kick. Oh, he might be out. Oh, another one. Again, amazing. Oh, very nice. Oh, he's stunned again. He's got him hurt here. Oh. 30 seconds to go. And now he lands a combination. He's teeing off with some vicious shots. He's hurt again! Back to his feet again, amazing! Wow! Wow! Leg two winding job, guys. down. Job. Oh, so what an end to the round. He got knocked down just before the final horn. You can classify that at... Okay, ready? Round two? You ready? Let's Second round underway. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Oh, oh, he's limping. Every wow. He's in big, big trouble. 
Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some... Whoa! There's a nice inside leg kick. He's got him hurt here. Attack that arm. He's isolated the arm. He's pinning down the wrist. Now he wants to connect his other hand to his forearm for leverage. That arm looks locked to me. And he got his arm loose. Oh, he's going for his arm now. And he got the it out. Point of the fight. Back to his feet. Moving left hand misses the target. Well, a really oh! nice. Oh! Oh! He hurt him. This could be it right here. Body kick. Look at that. And, oh! and just oh, like no, that, no, the no, fight no, is no, over. No, no. He threw an incredibly large volume of strikes, but this last one was the big one that landed for the knockout. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. Joe landed flush, and I'm not even sure the... Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer...